best raise my hood here. Please, please, spare me some coin. Oh, if you have none, I take blessing. Eivor of England. You sent for me. Said the Queen was in peril. I did. Come with me. Look at these workers. Working happily. Working with pride. The beauty of my family vineyard depends on them. And the quality of the wine is their doing. They are not beasts of burden. They take as much pride in these grapes as I do. I'm not here to admire your vineyard. No. But this is more than a vineyard. It is a vision of Francia. A vision that cannot exist under Charles. Ah, pluck the grapes right on time, Roland. Très bien. Dependable as always. Merci, monsieur. These grapes produce the wine that my vineyard is famous for. I admit, there is an uncommon beauty to these lands. Hmm, <laughs> indeed. Come. I am slower than I once was. My physician says the wounds you have delivered should have taken me. You chose to have that fight. And you fought for your people and for your honor. I do not hold it against you. Any true leader would have done the same. We are more alike than we first appear, Eva. And I will carry the scars to Romani. I feared my message would not get past Siegfried's many axes. Siegfried has left these lands. Those axes belong to Toka Simenik's Dotir now. That should be cause for celebration. But I fear Toka is yet another devil in a male shirt. Toka has learned much from Siegfried. Some of what she has learned is how not to be. I hope you are right. Your message said Rishardis was in peril. Is that really why you sent for me? These men represent the growing rebellion against Charles the Fat. I now accept the bitter truth that I find more honor and courage in you, Eivor, a northern invader, than in my own king. Honor is not bound by country or creed. Indeed. And it seems Richardis also knows this. She and that bastard Bernard are more than mere pawns in Francia's future. Bernard. A part of me wanted to hand him over to Charles. 
What grace you possess prevented you from condemning the boy to a hell in this world. He is better off with Richardis. Where is the Queen? She's hiding in a tavern in Amiens, guarded by my men. But those men have not reported back in... too long. I will find Richardis. I'm duty-bound to return the aid she once gave me. And... she is my friend. There is one more thing. This rebellion will succeed. And when it does, my path to the throne will be well charted. Your true ambitions. I was a loyal servant to Francia, to Charles, and to God. But Charles has been exposed. You want a Frankish king who will never march on England? I am that king. If I kill Charles for you. If you kill Charles for Francia, we would not forget. No. Murdering Charles on the hope it will bring security to my clan is not the kind of deal I mean to make. I misjudged you, Eivor. You stand before your people's best hope. Enough. You offer a promise you cannot keep, Odo. I will go to the tavern in Amiens and find Richardus. Fine. Bonne chance, Eivor. I will pray for you to succeed where my men have not. Need to cloak myself here.
yellow petals, both with green stems. Stretch your wings, Sunan. Tavern keep. What happened here? Hide! I am not sure it has gone. The monster, so much blood. Just hide! Better to look around myself. There's a dead monk upstairs, and a scroll in a tongue I do not understand. It's uh, probably scripture, written in Latin. The boy prince reads Latin. Bernard? Oh yes, they were here. That monk was his teacher. He's from the church here in Amiens. I heard the queen tell Bernard to go to the priests and nuns there when he is in trouble. Then I will look in on this church, and hope to find the queen there. Sling is around here somewhere. But not as here. Uh. Best not to draw attention here. You hear what Charles means to me? She's a witch. Nobody should be burned alive. It is blind course. It's a look with.
it's you. What happened? The monster took us to father's villa. But Richard Lees distracted him, and I snuck through the construction, along the wall. There is a tower there. And if you climb and climb, you can go right over. Where is Richardus? Where is the queen? The monster. She left with him. You mean the one who slaughtered so many at the tavern? He said we'd be brought to father for something. A test. I was... What kind of test? I... He called it a trial. Yes, that is what he said. A trial by fire. At father's villa, here in Amiens. He means to burn her alive. Go, Bernard. Go to your house in Lisseur. I will see to Shadis. I can help. I know things. You do not have to hurt my father. He is just... He gets confused sometimes. You must keep yourself safe, Bernard. The fate of Frankia depends on your survival. It will be a grand task for you to sneak all the way down to the Seine alone. This is a hero's burden. Are you up for it? I can do it. Good. Now go. Keep going, and do not look back. I will see to Richardis. Au revoir, Evo. Show me what lies ahead.
My feet ache. The renovations better be worth all these double shifts. They won't be. Guide me. The king. I heard it will be a trial by fire. It cannot be. Surely God will stop this. It appears that God himself is here to bear witness to this trial. May he show infinite mercy on the innocent. And if one is guilty of lying, scheming, committing adultery, may his holy wrath vanish your wicked soul. I have nothing to fear from him. It is you, Charles, who must seek his forgiveness. <laughs> we will soon know who God has blessed with his favor. My guardian angel approaches. That is no angel. Before my king, and before God, it's time I send this Diable back to hell where it belongs. Alive. Stand aside, Bishop. Your god does not bring men back more than once. For Angelwyn! For little mother! For my brother Ebels! I will purge you from this place! Out of my I will kill you.
I must find Bernard. Bernard is safe. I sent him back to the house in Lucerne. Once again, he uses you. You radiate God's grace, Eivor. You mistake grace for the flash of victory. Poor Bishop Guzla. I will pray for his soul. He served the Lord the best way he knew how. Charles and I need to talk. It may be the last time he talks to anyone. No. He is a wounded man who was tortured as a child. Burnt and burnt again. His whole life is fear. Fear of fire. Fear of God. Fear of disloyalty. He deserves mercy. Not a moment ago, he was to have you burned alive. What would you have me do? Spare him. Subdue him somehow. I can take him to a remote cottage in the east, where he will receive priestly guidance. There, we can live out quietly while I continue to prepare Bernard to succeed Charles. I assure you, he will grow up to be a ruler without ambitions for England. Spare Charles, and your people will be safe. Fine. If I can, I will spare him. But I need to be sure he can abide these terms. I know you will do what's right. The Lord works through you, and he is merciful. Father, bless these men who stand humbly in your judgment.
I should search the upper level. I will burn you! I know your fear! I have fire! I'm not him. I'm not the king. Gods. Strange. Christian holy book. No key inside. Another key. I should try these on the main hall door. The angel, the, the saint, the one who shimmers with the Lord's light. And so they were right about me. All of them were right. I know. We are what they say. It has always been us. Even as they seared me, I feigned to be purged of all demons. <laughs> But I knew. No amount of burning would rid me of you. And burn me they did. Below this scarred flesh, you were still there. You were still here. You have always been here. I embrace you, demon. Louder. We are the demon. We are... Uh... I am not the only demon who lurks in these chambers.
Maybe he will rise from the dead again. Fight me!
you? What have I done to you? It did not have to be this way. He left me no choice. No, you made a choice. You are not who I thought you were, Eivor. You are not an agent of the Lord. You are a murderer. Charles was a threat to my clan. He was mad beyond reason. And should your clan be a threat to one of your neighbors? I hope God grants them the wisdom you lack. Now leave us. Just know, Charles will never honor our bond with you, Northerners. Unlike him, my word can be trusted. Ha! You are no more than a wounded dog at my table looking for scraps. How dare you! Wait! Eivor! Finally, we can talk sense. What of Richard is? Did you encounter Charles? Richard is yet lives. Charles does not. This is an unexpected gift! That makes today a day for our celebration! It has been curious to know you, Eivor. You are as enigmatic as any Northerner I have met. He is hoping there are more like you. I must go now and attend the throne. I wish you a safe journey back to England. Your greatest challenges lie before you, Count Odo. I hope you have the strength. As do I. Is it wise to put our trust in him? You should not trust Odo, or any other leader in these lands. Not fully. Odo's duty is to his people. As is mine. And as long as your ambitions do not cross his, there can be a reprieve from the bloodshed. I have much to consider. Stay true to your honor, and bring glory to your people. If you do that, you cannot fail. I will send word should the Franks grow an appetite for England again. To your relations with Odo, consider returning to him the lands that Charles pledged to Siegfried. No. Those lands are compensation for the hardship he has caused us. Odo kept Paris. That is enough. You sound more y'all like all the time. And now I must think of my own people, whom I have been away from for too long.
Before you go, have this. It was my father, Sinrix, the second best leader and teacher I have known. It has been my honor. I hope to lead as well as you do, Eivor. If ever you hunger for more Frankish cheese, I will be happy to share. <laughs> Farewell, Toga. Are we safe? It will be many winters before Frankish troops land on the English shore. My spies say Paris fell. It did. But the situation is thornier than that. In what way? I killed the Mad King, Charles the Fat. Odo, the Count of Paris, means to take the throne. Is that good for us? Time will tell. But Odo is an honorable man, and he has a kingdom to rebuild. That is comforting. We also have a hardy ally in Toka Sindrikstotje. She is young. And a quick study. <laughs> she will do right by us. Perhaps they need not know the danger we face. We came home with bounty, glory, and some Frankish foods. I can ask the raiders to keep their tails to that. They will say everything, and then some. <laughs> Afraid so. <laughs> New strength comes to weather tolls. Now I can rest. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 